life going so again they're fucking hopeless potholes fucking roundabouts traffic lights doesn't it ever fail life going so managed to fuck some up yeah you might have to do that again because I had all the channels muted well yeah. thanks <laughs> <laughs> You didn't tell me where to start. What did I say tonight? What did I say? <laughs> Brilliant. Right, anybody on your stream, this is an added bonus. <laughs> 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 Mark's prepared. Stuff fucks up. Oh, it's just the... Oh, dear. Right. Uh-huh. Like I say, I could go on about five minutes. I'm disengaged. Just going to be dead. Right, edit point start starting here. Dinny, show boobs. Boobs. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Alright, we'll start for you. Fucking Fife Council. They've got fucking everything. Potholes, wheelie bins, fleeing all over the place. I don't know how many wheelie bins I've had. Fucking traffic lights everywhere. I'm sure they've got a tracker on my car. When they fucking see my number plate coming, they put the lights to red. I'm positive that happens. Can I ask how it's Fife Council's fault for wheelie bins blowing a wall? <laughs> no, no, it's Fife Council's fault for when they're on the street. For heavy, they're staying normal, right? But what they do is, they just fucking empty them and leave them in the middle of the street. They then they put them back in the bit that's kind of sheltered for the wind, where all the else that, lives That's up. not their job, that's your job. I bet I'm not fucking going out at half, half past eight chasing no, the wheelie bin in problem. the street. <laughs> Stop my problem. It's the wheelie bin guy that comes round, right? And they just fucking leave them in the middle of the road. And they blow them off. And then I have phone five coons, so could have another wheelie bin off for fuck's sake, Mark. I'm surprised they even bother today, you're stupid. <laughs> okay, I'm yeah, surprised too. Yeah, abuse you give them I, I reckon they've got me on speed there, like, they, they, they see the number coming in, that's that cunt again. Forward them to that department. Yeah. Actually, phoning Peter Vardy last week, we'll get back to Fife Council, this is not over on Fife Council. <laughs> I spoke to five different departments before I got my fucking car in for its recall thing. You know, every second is a highlight. Five, five departments. I reckon how, but at one point I got put to the sales department. I phoned for. <laughs> I got a letter. My car recalled something about the brakes. Great. Two months later, I eventually phoned them back. Probably wasn't the most brightest thing today, but I eventually phoned them anyway, and I got transferred through about a hundred different departments. Five exactly. Maybe I exaggerated. But and one at one point I was put through to sales. So you're getting the death car fixed then. <laughs> Hey, uh, no. there's nothing wrong with that car. It's fucking fantastic. Bar the fact the brakes could fail. The, the brakes could fail at any point. Aye, it's cool though. It's cool. It's not like I drive to Edinburgh every day or every second day. Actually, when was the last time you drove to Edinburgh? Actually, that's a good point. <laughs> Quite a while. And back to Fife Council. Fucking, you you try to drive to Edinburgh, but you can't. Even. There's forty fucking mile speed limits everywhere. That might have changed since the last time you were there. No, I only you. If anything, it'll got fucking worse. The past thirty cones. miles an hour now. I can fuck off with that. Apparently McKenna says the reason for it is there's vibrations in the road or something. Vibrations? Vibrations for what? The fucking boulders that are there taking a shite. That's funny, that's not the first time that she's felt vibrations uh, while talking to you. I think she just vibrates herself, fucking... Anyway, we should have said things like that. 40 mile... Ah, uh, I fucking hate that. 40 mile an hour. Who's driving 40 mile an hour? It's, it's unacceptable. Then it used to roll through. No, it used to drive. Aye, imagine that being in the speed limit. <laughs> 40 mil an hour. They should be banned. No, no, no. no. What they should be banned is the fucking signs that they put up everywhere saying you have to drive at 40. And average speed cameras too. I don't even mind the signs. I could ignore the signs. Can I ignore the average speed cameras? Because you get fined. But they weren't fined. No. At least that stops you from speeding. It does. That's about the only thing. Either that or a big fucking red lights. I didn't go through red lights often. (laughs) (laughs) Aye. Uh, That was one. I remember that time. uh, it was four o'clock in the morning. No, it wasn't. Aye, it was. Half past four three. o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> well, uh, that light's red. Who is it? <laughs> oh, well, too late now. Aye, we only got around the corner. It was perfect. Just a uh, minor, minor detail there. Uh, anybody else got anything to say about Five Council pissing me off? No, we all love Five Council. No, you didn't. We do. No, you didn't. Five Council's great. Five Council are pish. No, we like them because they annoy you. Aye, that's the only... You like anything because it annoys me. If Hitler annoyed me, you'd fucking support him. Do you like Hitler? No. Does Hitler annoy you? Not particularly, but it's, <laughs> it's not. It was just an extreme case I was trying to come out with. But I came what you like. Anything that... You just do anything to annoy me. Can I get a drink? You can away and fuck <laughs> yourself. You can wait till we're finished recording. 
Yeah, yeah. Craig, halfway through, you just got and knocked all the microphones out. No, that was hard. I never did that. You to did. be fair, I did not you, at least you never broke one. That's true. <laughs> I never broke a microphone, I broke a clip. Slightly different. Which is very important for the microphone <laughs> to stay connected yes. to the microphone stand. Aye, we did have to sell a tape it for quite a bit. Uh, by the way, while we're moaning about stuff like five concerts, Michael White's birthday. Uh, Happy because birthday, Mike. Related in any uh, which way at all? No, well, they're not really, but I, I didn't really want to do a proper transition, so there you go. Mm. I, I wasn't even going to mention it to Boris, but since he was so nice and said he so, listens every week. Well, the transition is that Michael's happy about you moaning, so. Yeah, Michael's always happy, though. He's like one of the fucking Prozac bastards. <laughs> Can't, Craig's off the quiet, I know. He's, he's sitting, pl- you watching porn again? I think his mic was working. <laughs> No, no, still, I'm, trying find still, that still, I'm trying to find that story about Five Council about their budget just so we could see as you're on about Five Council. Oh, right, I see. It's just never let you be quiet or talk about anything else but boats. Well, another news. No boats! <laughs> no, no boats. No, no. Uh, Sainsbury's plans approved for Newtown in Edinburgh. Eh? Sainsbury's going to make a new town? No, <laughs> new town in Edinburgh. <laughs> what? You know. It's the new town and the old town in Edinburgh. There's two. There's going to be another change in it. Fuck off. I've got enough of them. There you go. Simple fact. You might get a job at that one. I could get a job at Murrayfield or Blackhall, but they're about five fucking minutes apart. What's the need for two stores like that? Of course. It's fucking idiots. They'll be jogging past the Sainsbury's uh, on the Meadows Marathon as well. I'll make sure to bring a donut then. Fucking... No, I wouldn't waste a donut. They throw it out of the window. I'd eat the donut. Oh. Probably before I got there. Yeah, I'd, I eat the Edinburgh. I'd eat the Edinburgh. I'd eat the donut before I got there. Ah, so it's Michael White's birthday. I reckon what's no. it, 1920? Who cares? I'll just leave ages out of this video. Uh, happy birthday, Michael. Uh, happy birthday. Uh, keep listening, because somebody fucking has to. Otherwise, it's just me talking to myself. Would you be doing regardless? Oh, I would do. That's the point. I would do either way. Uh, oh, news for next week, though. We should mention it's Independence Special, which we need folk that are uh, for independence because everybody so far is like Craig and is against it and that's no use. No good. I think this is only like a four or five hour long debate. Well we might split it over two weeks because I, I can you kind of make the week after. No, so I'm saying if you do it on the once on Aye. next, we- uh, next um, Monday. I'm sure you could Chris- release it over two. Aye, mm-hmm. that's, I think we might end up doing that. I, I know Christina's coming. Uh, that's about it so far. Craig was in charge of finding political people. <laughs> I know. Uh, I mean, harsh. It's been did, harsh. Did I say anything? Uh, no, we, 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 we said we said to Craig, right, to Craig, right. You you find somebody that's good at politics. Well, I did ask, but they're busy, so make, make them that. unbusy. What another, do they mean? Another valuable point they're, they're made. Yet again, the boy has escaped the wheelie bin. I know he's <laughs> maybe broadcasting for the wheelie bin, and <laughs> he's not doing it. Yeah. No. What fucking, do you say? He's a knob. Uh, I independent special next week. Uh, so if you're around the politics, let us in because we need we need folk to come in. Uh, well, hopefully there'll be somebody else that's for independence. Either that or I'm just going to hit shout freedom in the street and hope somebody <laughs> comes running. Uh, and as as of next week as well, hopefully if the postie fucking gets out his bed and gets here in time, we'll be doing the video stream in HD. And all the videos for now on going up on YouTube should be in HD as well. And oh, there you go, we never mentioned that last week either. All the videos for the past are on YouTube now. Because you, you actually did it last Tuesday, not last Monday. But anyway, uh, YouTube. No, I had to go to YouTube because you stream were going, oh, we want £100 a month or $100 a month for you to keep storing the videos. So we thought, well, fuck that, we'll go to YouTube. They're better anyway. And have less adverts. So there you go. Fuck you, YouTube. Must ask, have you got a uh, uh, plan to tell the viewers of your uh, recent purchases? Oh, no, I wasn't. There. Yeah. Toblerone Tracker dot com and oh, they purchases. Uh, compare the Toblerones dot com. Is that what you're talking about? Aye. The sites aren't alive yet, but the domains are, have been I bought. I just want to come up purchases. Craig was thinking about. <laughs> okay, he's probably well, like, he's seventy odd quid free. worth of stuff for his freezer. Hmm. Which you had great fun opening the boxes. I did. He was throwing boxes about my kitchen. Yeah. Oh, there's another fiasco to talk about. The frost in the freezer. <laughs> <laughs> The, the uh, freezer was defrosted. Fine, the delivery man came and he was like, "Is it defrosted?" Oh, well, well, ah, but he never. He, the bit we're talking about is when uh, you came Ben and went, "How long does it take the freezer to defrost?" Well, it could be a couple of years. Take it, you have put like say towels <laughs> or boxes doing that to collect the water. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, no. fair enough. But then I did go and get. Did you swim through your kitchen <laughs> to get there? I did. You did not. It took that fucking long to defrost it. The boy was here and the fucking stuff for the eggs. 
You even but, found hidden notes. I was about to say paper underneath all the frost. To be fair, that freezer did make it through two world wars. Mm. Like, no, that's not even a joke. I think it did actually make it through two world wars. It was in my fucking grand's uh, under the stairs for about six years, I think. Sixty, maybe. Fuck, I reckon. Oh, dear. However long the two wars were. <laughs> it lasted a while, anyway. <laughs> fucking hang probably had dynamite underneath this, I reckon. Anyway, this, the thing was ancient. It's like a fucking ancient thing. You, just picture the oldest thing ever. Never run on coal. Uh, no, even coal. Is there yeah. a, a, a mark at your studio? No. No. Coal at the back. Oh, the, uh, that's yeah. just the, the desktop. It's not a Mac. Is it not? I thought it was. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I forgot you. I showed you. Yeah. Is it just me or is there a lack of donuts in the room? <laughs> no, I've got a few. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you do have out of date. Milky Way. The, the, the Milky Ways are not out of date. You've been learning for them. I've checked the date. I bought. He'll tell you. When did I buy them? Tuesday. Tuesday. If they're out of date, I'm going down to that shop with a rifle and a fucking machine gun. <laughs> oh, the rifle God. and the machine gun. <laughs> well, I mean, is that just in case you miss? <laughs> uh, he's, he's going for the range. Just in case day, security get, get me at the door and they take my rifle, I could still sneak past with my machine gun. <laughs> You've clearly not thought this one through. Why, why would that be like that? Through? You like that, Chad Hogan? Chad Hogan? <laughs> oh, it's Kevin Bridges. Oh, fuck, I could do this all night and I forgot. Anyway. Hey, what's your next topic? I'm not sure. Um, anybody you? up for a pizza? Domino's or that? No. no. Yeah, okay. I need to, I could mur- I've got my machine gun. Go down to B&M's. It's not even B&M's, it's the one next well, to B&M's. Boone's got the offer on that. But that's no B&M's. No, it's not B&M's, but I'm saying they've got a pizza offer on. Oh, I pizza offer. If you want two pizzas for the price of one pizza. It's an offer at the I think it's two tennis the pizzas Taliban for six quid. What's, called? what's it called? Istanbul. Istanbul. It's Mark doesn't need the concept of 10 inch. <laughs> <laughs> no! Fantastic. I get it. The like <laughs> running joke in the podcast for about half hour week. It's very good. Vastly inaccurate, but nonetheless. Oh. Is it true? Do you have a small willy? No. Okay. That's not what Jenna says. Ooh. Jenna can say whatever she fucking wants. The pictures uh, are on the website. Was, You're welcome to check. She was telling us <laughs> you're, you're dirty dancing under the moonlight. <laughs> You think you're a different song than me? <laughs> <laughs> or are you just thinking he's wee um, Frozen Moon run? Mm. Oh, I, I didn't think, oh, she went in half of that. I, I've, I've not actually spoken to her in months. The boy's too slow for this, but I think we should get a new host. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Steve. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cheers, I'll just go back and fucking through my bedroom. Eh? I'll just uh, watch you it. Aye. We'll come get you. Uh, <laughs> fuck, he's off. <laughs> I reckon, like, it's just, they're nice to these guys, you bring them in, you give them Milky Ways and everything, and you fucking harass. Out of date Milky Ways. That, that Milky Ways are absolutely in date. I'm telling you, b and M's, I'll be doing there with a fucking rifle. Um, speaking of rifles, it's Michael White's birthday. Oh, you said we've already done that. We've done that story. That was actually a better transition than <laughs> the last one. Did you like that? I came when I'd already done the story, but I liked that transition. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it's much use of chocolate frying pan. Right? I like chocolate frying pans, they're useful. Especially if you're making hot chocolate. Exactly. Fucking two in one. It's a system, it's easy. Piece of piss. Speaking of that, he put fucking cheese in my fridge. Psh. Cheese. He bought a block of cheese. Uh, yes, I vaguely remember being tagged in this photo. <laughs> <laughs> cheese. <laughs> With Andrew D's. I'm not even here. It wasn't even there. I was, can I just point out, it wasn't me that tagged you. No, I didn't even no. tag myself. All I tagged was Craig. I had to throw a good sponge because it got cheese on it. Bro, fucking cheese. Cheese is banned from a house. It's fucking. It's like, like milk. I guarantee you, you'd been more upset if you'd left cheese on your bunker. Though. I, I, I would. Found it. I, I would. I would. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just upset that he brought cheese in the house. Cheese isn't allowed. They like cheese. I'm putting a sign up next week. No <laughs> cheese. <laughs> banned substance. <laughs> I do mind, this is about KVN, I'm not, you can bring your meth, you can bring your cocaine. So, so what you're saying is there'll be strip searches next week for cheese. Aye. I'm disappointed if there was <laughs> There will be. So let me get this right, cheese, cheese is a banned no. substance, but Anything. Jenna isn't he? What do you mean Jenna's no banned substance? You rugby tackled her at the door for trying to come in. You've never done a good job. No, she did get in, but she brought her fucking pal there. Stumbling about the house. Nah, that's when she was feeling sexy and free. Aye. Mm. <laughs> she was, she was flashing her ass and everything. Surprised she even kept her place. But anyway, let us know, get on that topic. <laughs> what was her name again? The wee Christy. midget lassie. Christy. Christy, do you, if you're listening, which way would you be listening? But if you are, uh, you're welcome back anytime. Uh, 
I've got the list of stories now they came up the fuck we're talking about. <sighs> you never lose. No, I know. I was prepared tonight. I had the list prepared before you even got in the house. I had the list prepared before your first shite of the day. Oh, the shite Can the I also... Day. Well, there you go. I stand correct. But they plan on him one the day. You day plan on a shite the day? No. <laughs> that. <laughs> That's two right. yesterday. Did you also notice? Also, I washed the flare. Really? Aye. Fucking wood polish and everything. Aye, there you go. Never fucking done a good job at then. Eh, uh, fuck you! The flare was washed because the last time Christina was here, she brought big fucking bits that big prints all over the place. There's marks all over the flare. Well, wait, you fuck, there is not. Look there. That's just Mate, a hoover. Oh no! That's just that's that's, you, that's uh, you fucking shedding your hairs again. You washed your windy yet? No, no, the windy, the windy yes. like <laughs> <laughs> That has come for the couch because I think didn't he put that on my mark here, bastard? I wasn't. I was. All <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, I thought you were gonna put it on that. Yeah, that's what we could I do with the cheese. I even I even fixed the couch, the two clips. It is. Keep it. That's joined. what we could do with the cheese. Fixed it. Cause your big ass broke it. What you want to do with the cheese? Put in there marks away. This. Your cheese is a banned substance. It's like boats. It's banned. Get what you can do with your Speaking cheese. Put it on a fucking boat and you can take it away somewhere else. Drown the bastard. <laughs> Drown the tree. <laughs> in a boat, aye. But this is a Titanic situation. But instead of people, cheese. <laughs> get rid of it. Fuck it all. No. Put the cheese on the boat. Put a hole in the boat and get rid of it. Is that every type of cheese? Aye, oh cheese, any cheese, even milk. So, so you're not getting any pizzas for anyone then? No, 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 pizzas are fine. Oh, no, that's you need that's cheese fine. For but, but see, you're not going to take the cheese after pizza. Like, <laughs> that's, 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 too, that's too complicated. The pizzas that I've already acquired, the cheese could stay. Oh, that's yeah. that's so, frozen cheese so, on a so, pizza! So, right. so, when the cheese has been adapted to different situations, it's fine, but absolutely. cheese on its own must go. <laughs> right, so Mark, see, Mark, Genetically modified how, cheese on a pizza is acceptable. How do you propose We'll get the cheese for the pizza if you chuck the pizza. Thing is, away. Craig, Kim, what he's forgetting you, right? We need to get rid of these pogo stick cows for to get rid of the cheese. <laughs> no, not at all. Pogo stick cows are fine because they they have they they're fine because they do, they eat the grass. They keep the grass cut. They also make loads of dents in the grass as well. The pogo <laughs> sticks. <been. laughs> no, it's coming. See, have you dropped a, a cow for a? Sc- we've mentioned this before. Have you dropped a cow for a skyscraper? What it would need is a tail. Well, <laughs> what we need is a tail. Uh, a pogo stick tail. Oh, no, no, you're, no, you're running the mill standard tail, but your pogo stick tail. And, and Bincy Boffy. I've feet. got a different scenario for you. <laughs> what <laughs> happens if we push Craig off the top of a skyscraper? Oh, I'd make my day. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'd, I think he's due in court. Anybody that can see the video, he's got a shirt on the night. <laughs> I'm telling you. And that brings us to the story. Why is he due in court? There was, a, there was a guy that got stabbed in Kennaway last night. Was there? There's ah, about five, six weeks in the chart. You brought that up! Five, six weeks in the chart, I wore a shirt and you never said a word. You weren't a June court though. I'm not June court. I think you are. Well, you should be. Are you pleading guilty? No. Are you guilty? No. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you are, boy. Totally not. Ah, uh, yes. Ah, you can tell with the eyes. Ah, uh, he's got the serial well, killer look eyes. Look at the look. Ah, uh, definitely. He's got the haircut of a serial killer, uh, too. Ah. Uh, I mean, is that blood on his ears? He's, yeah. he's not even washed after he's killed. That's what it is. That was actually white, that shirt. Ah, uh, it's blood. That's all the blood in the Either dirt. Either that or he's dressing up for Valentine's Day, but you're a bit early. It's Valentine's Day in the morning. There's fucking floors everywhere. I think he's dressing up. It's just another scam to get folks to buy kids. And floors. Alright. Chocolates. Ish. Ish. Oh, oh, I'll buy chocolate anyway. Alright. Aye. That's a regular Tuesday, uh, it's though. Prostitute's busiest night of the year. Or so I'm told. I wouldn't <laughs> <laughs> Well, sure. Mark, I'm not even saying a thing. How busy are you, Mark? <laughs> uh, well, it's my night off. Uh, I can't remember what my point was. Oh, Craig's a serial killer. Craig's a serial killer. I'm not sure in the family. A couple of weeks ago, you had a serial killer, Gran. You're a serial killer. Did it skip your mum's generation? Or is she secretly a serial killer? Oh, you're I'm going to have to ask her. So so there you go. Go. <laughs> Just tell me I'm getting shot. He's a fucking serial killer. <laughs> Telling you. He's doing court though, he might not get to I'm kill I'm surprised you never told your serial killer joke there. Oh, with the cornflakes? Mm-hmm. Mm, telling you. I've, I've used that in Which too much. I'm right, some certain people didn't get that joke. No, they didn't get it. I'm a serial killer. You should have seen what I had for my breakfast. <laughs> you yeah, can that joke, nip, nip. Sitting there two hours later laughing at it. Just right out of the heat. Aye, ah, exactly. Fucking morons. Ah, there was another bit of that too. Ooh, I had crunchy nuts. Sit on a breakfast. <laughs> 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 uh, 
So anyway, I'll just yeah. moving on. I always thought you were a right nut muncher. You would can. But you did, you did say you were going to. You, you did say you were right? going to nibble my bits. That's no, true. that was Chloe. Mm. That was Chloe. No, you that weren't here. Well. You weren't here. Fucking deflower yourself. Thanks. <laughs> 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 oh dear. Speaking of child porn. This guy, he, he worked for the oil industry. He was one of the big wig bastards that make all the money. <laughs> 50,000 pictures of child porn and he escapes prison. Sorry, the link there was I was claiming Chloe was a child and that was the link. Oh, all right, right. I, I was just thought you might have been suggesting that Chloe's got loads of child porn. I, I'm not sure. I, our laptop is a bit funny bits. Aye. It could take anything Which on that. One? I think the computer you're right was moaning about but blows up. Uh, oh, aye. Aye, aye. convenient, eh? Can you the police knock at the door? Can I check your computer? I'm holding it for a friend. Aye, it's my dad's. Aye, okay, Chloe. How do you watch her? I could remember our last talk on child porn. I ended up with discussions of pictures of your roof <laughs> and uh, other things. I know, and I had to keep it fucking doing, I know. Aye, do, uh, do you can why the guy was. Um, we sort of escapes prison. You can I, I do, Craig. I'm prepared, and I'm I know good. why he escaped because he told the police about the network of all the other ugly fucking pedophilic bastards. So that's what happened. If you get captured, you just say, well, Aye. See, I'm, I'm you used so, to did it, Aye. so let me so I'm off. fine. See if I ever get caught. I'm just telling him about your drug operation, and I'm fine. Ah, but then I'll just tell him about your prostitution, and I'll be fine. We're both fine. We'll both get a lot free. Perfect. As long as the, the police get a net gain. Like ah, but that's not right. They should, what they should have done was lie to him. They should have said, right, tell us about the network and we'll let you go. And once you tell them, get it, fuck it up, you fucking hundred years. Or shoot them. That's why I'd do, I'd shoot them. Fucking paedophiles. Get them shot. Shot. And blown up. Same with the murderers. Boom, right in the head. Fucking deed. I'm just going to keep talking. All right. Well, he's not been convicted yet. It's court date is due the morn. It's unusual for you to wait for conviction. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm all about justice, these. Uh, you can judge and jury. Executioner, if you get your way, I know. Exactly. No, that'd just be me. Just me. That's from saying you're judge, jury, ah. and executioner. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I'd come round right to your house, guilty, boom, deed, gone. Fantastic. Either that or deport, deport you. If you've not done a too serious crime, you could live in Africa and starve for quite a while. But I, wait, I, wait. I, that was your policy, your scheme, uh, one in, one out. It's, uh, it's an exchange <laughs> scheme, right? Because you see the folk in Africa that are nice and that haven't committed crimes. So, and that so ba- basically, swap. what you do is you get rid of somebody that robs a house and you bring somebody there that's a war criminal. Great policy, No, no, war criminal. No, 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 no. Well, like, a wee, a wee like, five-year-old that's, like, starving. We'll bring him here and we'll get rid of the paedophiles. See? Starving what? Marvin. Well, his name necessarily doesn't have to be Marvin. I mean, some of them have got funny foreign names. We'll, we'll bring some of them to you. Who are you laughing at? I'm sure on this couch She's just she's just here. laughing because she can she'll be the first one to get deported. <laughs> no, that child porn. Aye. Telling you that computer that's our dad's. Ah, right. Moving on. Okay, we'll move on. We're moving what? through these quite fast. I know that's because I'm, we're going to wrap up quite quick today because uh, Cheerio. I don't care why because I've forgotten. Because it's Mike White's birthday. It's because it's Michael White's birthday and uh, uh, we're, we're, we're having a party in his honour, but he's not invited. Aye, uh, <laughs> why would we invite him? Uh, why did I invite you? What are you doing here? <laughs> not uh, You invite me this week. So I even get what I'm doing here. Aye, uh, what the fuck are you? So that's why I'm. That's why I'm what? At least you admit you're late. Uh, right. Craig, tell us a story. You've normally got something you could talk about. Um, well, I better not be a bit boat. I stabbed somebody last night. No, 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 no. I was going to say, just just for your pleasure, Mark. My pleasure. Aye. It's never like the, you. Um, pleasure. <laughs> the HMS Daring has been. No, it's a boat! <laughs> it's a fucking boat! Uh, no, 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 no. Michael, Mike, if you're listening to this, I'm sorry to ruin your birthday, but uh, we're not talking about boats. Ranger, <sighs> Rangers Football Club are fucked. There's a story we'll talk about. <laughs> well, ah, been, I do like I do like. I've been fucked for quite a while. Ah, but you've been fucked right in the arse now. <laughs> no, I've been getting fucked in the arse for quite a while, I know. You've been fucked in the ear now then. You've been watching too much Family Guy. <laughs> I've not actually watched Family Guy, it's just... No, I'll leave it at that. Tell us about Rangers Football Club and why they're pish. There's, there's, <laughs> there's not really much to tell, Mark. It's just might go into administration. They haven't paid the tax, man. Oh... Bastards. The tax man will always get in. Ah, hmm. quite right. 
Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. I pound fucking tax. Why your Rangers not pound tax? They have been pound tax. I do th- believe th- you. Th- this has gone back to advocates years, which will be ninety eight to two thousand. Mm-hmm. I'm not a drink. New year gone back a bit. And then, even then. They say it's because of the tax. We've not actually been hit with anything for the tax yet. We could still get half of it. They're arguing that it's tax avoidance and no tax evasion. Is there a difference between avoidance and evasion? Mm-hmm. What's the difference? Well, I'm a dick in the ends and outs because I've, I've not covered this in my H&D accountancy yet. Oh, it's not but like you're an accountant or anything. Come on. No, I've just, I just came out and said that. <laughs> I thought I'd repeat it for emphasis. Yeah. But, eh... Uh, the difference is along the way. You're, you're allowed tax avoidance where it's not actually... Illegal. Yeah, that's basically. You're allowed you're, to avoid tax. No, you, I will. You try to cut down your tax, basically. Your oh, minimum, how much you pay them. Tax evasions when you pay them fuck all. What Rangers done? Rangers was paying them tax, but what they're saying is it's the day with the wages. They're putting the wages into a benefit uh, scheme. It was an employee benefit scheme. They're putting them into that. Seems dodgy. To me. HMRC is saying that very this dodgy. Is tax evasion. Oh. Where Rangers are saying this is tax avoidance. The reason this is the test case because there's loads of clubs in football and th- rugby that have done this. Eh? So if Rangers gets hammered, then everybody else, the, hammered. The else will get hammered. If Rangers gets, I'm off. glad they started with Rangers. They, uh, they must be the worst. Ra- no, because well, Rangers, you're only talking about forty nine million. Only forty nine million. Well, That's all. Mark, you got like say Fernando Torres. He was a player that went for fifty million and the transfer. Only one player was fifty million. Fuck, forty nine million. I get about forty nine pence a day. No, and then yeah, you've got clubs like um, I mean that's tax like, debt. See Rangers when we were in the Champions League last season we had uh, Man United and Valencia in their group. Between them they're one point three billion in debt. Mm-hmm. In debt? Aye. For what? What what in debt? Well, they need to stop paying the players as much. Manchester why are they paying, why are they paying least, players uh, as much? Manchester United debt? That's, was when we played in was seven hundred million in debt. <sighs> Valencia was six hundred million in debt at the time when we played. Jesus we were thirty million in debt, and yet we had all this transfer embargoes and well, no transfer embargoes. Oh, I've lost my mind. All the fucking get radical. Obviously, they coming in and stopping us with doing stuff. Sometimes yeah. they but, stop you for doing ba- stuff. Ba- basically, some of we were told a few months ago that administration was a possibility. Am I right it's in saying you've lost ten points for that? No, no we've lost anything. If, if we do go into administration, administration we will lose ten points. See, but did you know you'd be relegated or not? No, is that not one of the? No, that's. What happened is thought I'll compare that things like say Livingston. Livingston went into administration twice in the space of about six years. Livingston, Livingston, is that even a team? Just four guys doing is, the is, this, is this your Leslie run a game but adapted to Livingston? Aye. Football? I mean it's a shitty hole. Aye. It's like say because Livingston went mental because Dundee went into administration twice in the same amount of time and Dundee never got demoted. Yeah, Rangers would be the first time they go in, but like when Motherwell went into administration, mm-hmm. just deducted ten points. I was saying that. Wonder really, they're still staying second place in the league anyway. Aye, yeah, that's the thing I thought I'd been talking about to show how bad Scottish football is. That even if we do go into administration, we get 10 points and a half, we're still 9 points clear. Third Where's plus. Aberdeen? Aberdeen. Seventh. Aberdeen's picked up in recent weeks. Oh, I like yeah. their 7th. Is it 6th, 7th? Aye. Like that. Trying to drew with Hibs at the weekend, 0-0. No, no. So they're about 6th. The worst 6th. Steve's looking like he's going to kill himself, are there? He's waiting on the total own tracking system up here. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, they're saying that like if Rangers were to be sort of like, like just go to existence totally, then it would actually destroy Scottish football. That would really. There's Which is a good thing. This guy talks sense. The, the thing like is, folks say that, what you remember with Scottish yeah. football, you've got thousands of fans travelling around the country. The amount of money that, you know, how much money, you, you, you drive, Mark, how much money is made in petrol to the government? <laughs> fucking, um, for the government, fucking at all. Right, well, it just you talks you about the amount of supporters buses that travel everywhere around Scotland during football, right? We've got buses go to Rangers games for Inverness, Aberdeen. Hamish? Well, he goes to watch Inverness instead of the Rangers. But oh, well, I there's there's, even, Rangers there's even buses that come up for, like, say, well, I think these far south as London and all that come up. Okay, well, I've not had talked about this week a lorry crash, and every week we've had a lorry crash. Deed lorries. Well, oh, this week. And if you'd phoned me on my way up, I would have maybe created one. But you'd have just yeah. walked in front of a lorry. <laughs> no! <laughs> I would have helped you. Yeah. Well, thanks. If Mark needs a story. Aye, uh, on you go. Crash. Well, just a bit of a lorry. That's too late now. How is it too late? It's never too late. It's comfy now. You're comfy. <laughs> no movement there. He's got but his shoes on. You can't get hit by a lorry anyway, it's fine. No. You can't be comfy if you hit by a lorry. Uh, Bill, you go out in there. No, no, no. I'm no. a guest in your house and you're asking me to walk out in front of guest, a lorry. Guest, guest is kind of putting that a bit inaccurate. Right, on you go then. Dickin, I was just going to imply that you're a, like one of the fucking... What are the folk that come in your house and just stay there? Squatters. That's the one. It's like that. It leaves eventually. 
And you say that, and I've, I've, I'm the one who, everybody in here that spent the least amount of time in your house the day. Uh, the day? The only the day. Because you were in the shed. I've not got a shed. Shh. I just ate a shed. He's got an attic. <laughs> Stephen wants to go in the attic to jump through the roof and land on Craig. Very harsh. We say it or no, I'd imagine. No. Oh, speaking of stupid folk, uh, a guy went into a police station with a shotgun. Was it you? No. <laughs> Can you ask that? Was it Chad Hogan? It was Ch- Chad Hogan came all the way from America with his shotgun. So it was Michael Pye. <laughs> I, I bet it was, fuck it. It was Craig. That's, again, that's another thing. It's probably, how many court cases have you got? <laughs> Where do you get these shotguns, mate? I reckon, like... I said he's a serial killer. He well, it says he's a 53-year-old man for a kick-off, so you're kind of... You must have had a shave after it. <laughs> you just went in with your fucking moustache on. I'm 53! Let me know that squeakiness. Your moustache on. <laughs> moustache. <laughs> what's, what's wrong with that? That's accurate, is it, no? Be a moustache, Mark. Not a moustache. A moustache. moustache is better. Oh, a moustache. I'm just going to keep rambling on till somebody stops me, as ever. He's an awfully quiet tonight. Uh, I'm, I'm, be- I'm beginning to think I should have just stayed in the house and had a game of dominoes, like. Ah, uh, me too. This is... Uh. The boy's supposed to be in um, Airdrie Sheriff Court in the morning. Christ, you better leave now if you want to make it to Airdrie the night. Morning, I'm sorry. glad I'm... Oh, it's the morning. Aye, but you, you do want to be sleeping here and then driving up in the morning. You're better leaving the night and staying up there. Pack your bags on that. So he's staying the night, and yet I'm the squatter. He's not staying here. No, he's staying <laughs> up there for his court case in the morning. morning. You're not following along. Air no, I, I just listen in and out to you. I think. Uh-huh. Selective hearing. Yeah. Exactly. Pro- point proven. Aye. So the guy walked into a police station. Do you can why, Craig? Why did he do this? Is he just a fucking moron? Pretty much. It doesn't tell you why. It doesn't. It? So he didn't have an excuse. It was basically. He was bored. He was bored. Well, I mean, I get bored, but I didn't go into the police station. And there was a six or a police, police station's the last place I'd go if I was bored. Most of it's Kennyway, there's nobody in that police station, is there? I didn't think it's a police station, and somebody's just painted a sign that says police. It's a scared folk, huh? I mean. <laughs> Craig's not happy. That's down, Kennyway, I'm disappointed. He, he's, the one that, he's the one that runs the Ned situation in Kennyway. <laughs> he runs them. No, that's, he, why, he that's, what, that, that's why he's wearing that shirt today, so they came what colours to wear the night. Gadget kingpin. Uh, yeah, I'm telling you. Oh, no. All the Neds that go about no, Craig no, no, coordinates no. them all. No, I'm not the chief chav. Ah, he is. He's ch- it's Captain, Captain, what's his name again? Captain Construction, Grandad Gopher, uh, what's the rest <laughs> of his name? Pythagoras Prick, uh, Wally the Wank. So you got me losing my mind with this, Mark. Oh, I can. Fuck it, it's unbelievable. But he's not the only guy that's had a shotgun this week. The, uh, an assassin businessman killed his brother. Mm, a, sho- a shot of pure, 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 <laughs> pure, shot pure, of, pure, uh, pure, shot pure, of pure, 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 Prior preparation prevents piss poor performance. That's something that you should take into account the next time you do a fucking podcast. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think you lost a wee bit in the middle there, but okay. What are you talking about? Every setting in this podcast is a fucking highlight. It's brilliant. Yeah, uh, we can do this all night. Aye, uh, we could. Oh. Do you say we're sparking up a rhythm? Aye, uh, that'll do. They want, they want to be eating double runs at this time of the night, you can. Though you've got a website for them now. Uh, just, need to get off your, just need to get off your fat arse and do something with it. <laughs> Cheers. Hey, I've updated the website, I'll have you know. The Meadows Marathon page is on the website. And I put something else on the website too. Videos. The videos are on can the website. Can I actually ask... For the viewers here, the one or two that might be listening. See, instead of when we post up saying, can you please give us donations, blah, 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 and things like that. Then they just like your wee comment on Facebook or share it. Actually, fucking donate. donate. <laughs> Don- <laughs> well, last week we said, for every pound that gets donated, you'll do a mile on the treadmill. Spe- speaking no, of the treadmill, you. what did we discover about the treadmill on Tuesday, Mark? Oh, it's inaccurate, the scale on it. No, it's in kilometres an hour. It's no. You thought it's kilometres, I thought it's miles, it's in between. <laughs> it's, no even, it's neither one because yeah. I use my phone to judge it it's in between the two it? see because that well when you said last week you could walk at a 6.5 miles <laughs> per hour pace yeah, that was I was going to say something <laughs> but I thought 
No, nah, the mere fun of it. That, that's what I was telling but, you. Jesus, that's a hell of a pace, Mark. Uh, I, it's it's not, it's not especially considering it took us two and a half hours to walk eight miles. That I, but that, to be fair, it took us two and a half hours because we did take Daniel. Oh, that's harsh. <laughs> that's harsh. Daniel, if you're listening, nah, you, 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 can can bring, you need to bring back Mr. Booth. Uh, Mr. Booth. He couldn't make it tonight because you blew up his car. Hey, there was a big bang. Wasn't me it caused it? I think I'm that boy's been there with that be car. You. It'll be you. I reckon the boy that bought his other car was right, maybe he's been racing it. Racing? Ah, he's, he's, he's a fucking racer, that dad, I'm telling you. Although, to be honest, on the motorway, I've seen I've seen Grands overtake him. <laughs> <laughs> ah, but we've got this plan, right? See, when we're in his car, we sit back, we let you speed ahead. <laughs> just to hope that one day we go past and go, <laughs> he's been pulled there for speeding! <laughs> uh, so we can all go past and go, hey! Uh, excuse you, over 10,000 miles and no points on that licence. I bet, that's because you've not been caught yet. <laughs> exactly, exactly. But that's the most important thing, is not getting caught. Really? Should it's your phone never be on silent, Mark? Okay, my phone should go on silent, but it's never on silent. I make a point every week saying to everybody, put your phone on silent, and I never put mine on silent. I used to forget. I do apologise. But, to be fair, the only person that's texted me is Craig, <laughs> because funny. he's a knob. It wasn't me there. It was you. So, check it, it again, it wasn't me. It'll be you. Anyway, do you want to text me? It's alright, you'll just hear beating in the background. Doesn't it bother me? Tell you what happened this week. Workman fell off the road bridge and he died. Uh, no, the road bridge, the rail bridge. Aye, right, close enough. They're, they're, they're the same thing anyway. Just ones for trains, ones for cars. So they're not the same thing. Ah, right, well, they're basically the same thing. I mean, they basically copied it and put it like five foot out of their side. Oh, cheers, Craig. Thanks. That for wasn't that. me. Check it. <laughs> no, I see these. It's best it'll be these, dude. Thanks, these. Fantastic as ever. Hey, ah, he fell off. He fell off the bridge. He didn't. He sadly didn't work for five Council. Yeah, and that's sad Mark. because. Right, I wasn't actually going to bother, but I'll take them now. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Cheers, these. I'll uh, make sure I delete that. I would point out that you weren't happy when Shannon sent you 60 texts in here. I think, well, if I could remember rightly, 48 rings a bell. Aye, 48 does ring a bell. 48 or 52, that was something like that. It was about the 50 mark. Yeah. Uh, you weren't happy, but yet you'll send me a hundred during this. Sent oh, four. Four. Which is the equivalent of what she sent me the other night. Aye, your phone. my phone, aye. Sorry about that. Well, the, the, the Shannon's no called Shannon anymore. She's Mark too. Mark <laughs> It's better in black. As Daniel will be rolling about. Oh, anyway. it's a quality story. Come on, Mark. Tell us the black story. I'm not telling you a black story. If you want to bring... I think this... Uh, you should save that for Daniel. Daniel likes to tell the black story. And I hate it. So let's not talk about that. Folk will be listening to this thing. Why are they not mentioning that wife team? Why are they not mentioning that wife team? Because we'll it's it no it. Scottish news. It's no sc- well, exactly. it's related similarly because there are folk in Scotland that are deed. Mm. She's deed. There you go. Relation. Right then, in that case you could link it to anything. Right, right. Exactly. There's nuclear power plants in, Sc- Craig. Be in Scotland. There's what? nuclear subs. Craig, if I remember boats. rightly, did folk not die in that boat? Ah, exactly. <laughs> We're it's not just, just where I need to go to bits there. Oh, still. fuck Ken. off. We're not talking about both. You've got nuclear subs banging about in Scotland. I'll so put a nuclear sub up your arse in a minute. Iran's the final I'll stab you in the ear. Really We're a rocket launcher. We're not talking about both. I was talking about Iran. I don't care if you're talking about fucking Gemma Jackson doing fucking cartwheels doing leaving High Street. We're not talking about boats. I was talking about Iran. It's a country. It's not a boat. Well, Iran... Iran is the boat of the Middle East. <laughs> exactly. Filled with cheese. Actually, it's probably Iranians, but I'll give you a point for that. Iranians are the new cheese. The two very easily mistaken. <laughs> <laughs> They're both smelly. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> if you're Iranian and you listen to this, what the fuck are you doing listening to this? We're the best racist podcast in the country. You know, okay, uh, you, if you just see Omi Jalele listening to this and who you on, that bastard. <laughs> Tomorrow, if he's listening, he can come on one week and stab me at school. Uh, Oh, no. But you're not denying fun. Iranians are quite smelly. I didn't care. I've never met an Iranian. I couldn't tell you Me if they're either, smelly. But I, I think if I met one, they'd be smelly. Or she. I do want to be sexist. So you can tolerate being racist, but you can't be sexist. It was for the joke, Craig. I'll take it out for the joke. Solid good humour. Solid good humour. Send hate mail to market who gives a fuck dot com. 
Ah, so the wife's dead. She wasn't a reign in, I doubt. No. <laughs> <laughs> she, she was American. Though in saying that, the film Bodyguard would have been a lot different if she was. <laughs> I've never seen that film. should watch it sometime. Uh, was she that's, an actual that's, bodyguard? That's, that's she didn't, she didn't look the type to be a bodyguard. She no, she wasn't enough. a bodyguard. She had a bodyguard. Why? Because she was a singer. Uh, but what, what she got it? death threats. I mean, I've never actually watched the film. No, I didn't it's Mary, she is. It's Mary that lovey dovey pish. Oh, aye, pish. Pish. Go watch that pish. Is that all of what, is anybody can, can I just, like, can I just ask? He's not even said who's dead yet. I'm just about to point out this one. Do you even care who it is that's dead? Whitney Houston, there's a There we go. Because she sang, uh, I Will Always Love You. I'll oh, cheers, Mark. Uh, no, I would, I'm not saying it to you. That's the song she sang. So the question is, who, who is he saying it to? Must be Jenna. Mm. I never said oh, that. You make me sick. Tell me, Dirty Dancing in the Moonlight. The what? I think, yeah, I'm, I, I reckon I should throw you off a bus. Can I show up your granny off a bus? I could throw you off a bus though. A moving bus. I could throw you in front of a bus. That's like a lorry. Deed, deed bus. That's the story of the night. Deed bus. We'll try to do that last time we had a wee walk to her Alright, eh? try to throw me in front of a bus. Mark was quite amazed that stagecoach has actually got a depot. They haven't got an office. Aye, they've got a depot. I, can, if I, can, I thought all stagecoach buses were in Leaden. I thought that's where they all were for the whole country. That's because you're a moron. Yeah, I, I've got to laugh though, right? They're sitting in the depot and it's like, this bus is not in service. No shit. Ah, but they've got to keep that. When it goes past you, ah. you go, oh, my bus is coming. Oh no, it's not in service. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? You, you you do that anyway, even if it isn't, even if it is your bus. You no, if it isn't service, I'll wait till I get on. Oh, then right. the driver. Then get off and then go, get right, 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 cheers driver, get off, but as soon as he shuts the door. Get up, yeah, exactly. No one, I'm coming out and chasing after me. Uh, I think, I think, Michael White's dad, was in, his granddad was a bus driver, remember? And he stopped at the scale and chased folk. Oh, aye. Aye, see, I what? remember. Michael White, I'm like fucking Columbo. He was there. This is where Michael White comes out and says, what are you talking about, Mark? <laughs> I remember. Because he was a bus driver. I can't remember his dad or his granddad or something. He was a bus driver. And he stopped at the scale and chest folk one day. This, this is something like the bingo so. call or something. Right, it's quite right. I'd, I'd be, I'd be eh? there with my This is something similar to the bingo caller story here. Can this just the bus driver family or... No. My granddad was a bingo caller. No, that's not a song, is it? <laughs> Uh, you've minus, right. minus points for that. Uh, that no, that's just a, that's an automatic sack, my friends. Yeah. Misquoting characters if he's still game and tuned the fart. Oh well. You're sacked. I was never hired. You've never paid me for this. Yeah, no, but you're still doing the money for fixing your clock. You're still doing me four in- invoices for fixing your cock. Exactly. Still bigger than yours. Uh, no any more. And uh, the wife, could we get back on track to the wife being dead? How did we get from Whitney Houston to you've got a wee cock? Well, we seem to get for anything, we seem to get for any other that. topic to you hang a wee cock oh, every other time. So oh, it was only a matter of time. Ah, uh, very good. It's Craig's turn next week. Ha <laughs> To be dead, he'll be in, he'll not be here next week. He'll be five, ten, court. twenty-five to life. In court. Aye, uh, twenty-five to life. So in other words, it was six months under nah, McCaskill. Probably, probably. No, fucking McCaskill. McCaskill should be the fucking head of Fife Council for a while. I'll tell you, the pair of them, Fife Council and McCaskill, morons, fucking hopeless. I mean, what basically what would happen is... The it's just McCaskill and Salmon, morons, hopeless. Uh, exactly. Salmon's not too bad. He's a moron. He has a moron. He's an arse. Near an arse than a moron. Aye, But McCaskill is, is a just moron a, and an arse. a complete fucking... Oh, the words we ought to describe McCaskill... Oh, I mean, basically, what what would happen is the judge would would go to Craig, right, twenty five to life, and McCaskill will walk in the court and go, "It's cool, give him a couple of days, that'll be." Uh, he, he looks a bit peaky. We'll, we'll give him a couple of years off uh, his sentence. We'll, we'll send him back to his home country, eh, Kennewy. <laughs> a home country. Ah, uh, well, Kennewy's like a fucking. It's like, oh Jesus. It's like a jungle. Uh, yeah, it's, Telling you, I mean, you walk up, uh, Ken and Buck Haven, you walk about, you might get mugged. I'll be honest with you. You walk in Kennewy, you're lucky to come out alive. That's harsh, I walk about there all the time. You're the one killing folk! <laughs> you're the one going about with knives and shotguns! No, you're doing no, caught no, no, for no. 45 offences! Hardly, I'm not at all. Mm, uh, uh, and Airdrie, I know. How did you manage Airdrie? You must have been, that must have been a hell of a walk one day for Kennewy. What's Airdrie? he been doing in Airdrie? <laughs> That's where the court case is, apparently. That's what he says. He's due there the morning. Craig. 
What? There's a point in some disappointment. He must just walk about Scotland with a fucking rifle or something. I mean, not that, not that there's anything wrong with that. I mean, I'd accept that walking about Scotland with a rifle. But you've got to care who to shoot. It's got to be justified. You can't just Aye, go... And, you've you can't got to know who to <laughs> shoot. No, no, I'm the one that decides who gets shot. I'm Pop, the decider. I thought Craig was... No, Craig just walks about shooting anybody. That's why he's in court for 45 cases. I'm mere relaxed about it. I just shoot the folk that deserve to <laughs> wait, be Wait, 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 wait. So you're mere... He's mere relaxed and shoots the folk that deserve to be folk, which is pretty much the majority of the country. That's really isn't from. mere relaxed. That's mere... Ah, but it's, it's, it's like you shoot. Aye, but I, I, I'm, I'm more careful. You just Speaking of relaxing, story. that's what they were saying that went to Houston had taken, was relaxing drugs. She, oh, well, I heard that one point she drowned in a bath. Well, she, did, I heard that one. she did drown in the bath, but there were like loads of tablets and that, like, or empty boxes kind of about that were for she, like, she were, like this, relaxing. I didn't so all these fucking easy, celebrities. She had had they drink get, as well. But she, no, because I'm talking about happy for once because it's. I came up talking about you, didn't I? Um, I came up talking about I'm talking about donuts, Toblerones, and absolutely everything. That's true. Um, but no, they're saying when you combine them with alcohol, it can actually knock you out. So they're written, because she had two nights partying, mm. and she took the, the calming drugs, and then she goes in the bath and drowns. But apparently she was found face down with her legs in the air, in the bath. I reckon the bodyguard so did that for a laugh. <laughs> you don't think? How do you find that funny, Craig? <laughs> I do. No. Do you know like the bodyguard just come in and seen her dead and thought, let's put her in a funny pose? <laughs> She's maybe washing shampoo at her hair. <laughs> and then quite unconscious. But no, which you know, <laughs> which you, I didn't. All these celebrities, they make all that money and they go and fucking get drugs. Michael Jackson was yeah, the same. What did you use in that? She was a big fucking. Oh, they're saying she's guy. actually. I mean, um, she must have been one of your customers at one point. She's apparently destroyed like Mr. Fortune like through drugs now. Right, but she'd all gone bankrupt. It was in the new Aye. salary. Yeah. And oh, it is saying here that um, our albums are now. Oh, oh I knew. It was the same with that. iTunes, Jackson iTunes is actually being slagged off because um, last night, the night before. When she died, rather, our, al- our greatest hits album went up to 4 and 7 and 9 within hours of her death. Well, I had music channels on last night, and you're flatting through them, it was Whitney Houston tribute, Whitney Houston tribute, Whitney Absolutely. Houston tribute, UK Top 40, Whitney Absolutely. Houston tribute, Whitney Houston tribute, Whitney Houston tribute, Whitney Houston tribute, Whitney Houston tribute, on and on again and again and again. I'll tell there, you. There was even some channels, right, that had it on for it was the same programme. To your programme, on. I've got a good blank for All this. the way through. you got a good blank, right? I'll make sure I'll fuck it up. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Just keep talking, <laughs> keep talking about Whitney Houston and I'll, I'll get to my link in a minute. You're just going to jump in. Uh, you, you give me the signal and then. The signal yeah. is new, shut up. Right, right. when you go. Whitney Houston, she's dead. Right, so that's one less musician. But I tell you. Right, okay. Well done, Columbo. I, 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 I'm Columbo. I had this story fucking prepared and everything. Wife did. Anyway. Magician, woman, singer. She's a magician. Musician. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was, I was getting magic. She, she, she made, she made dogs disappear up her arse. Anyway, musician. She's, she's disappeared. I will tell you though, we've still got one other. So she is, she is a magician then. She's just appeared. <laughs> you, you basically see my link transitions here to a good uh, thing, and you think, fuck that, I'm going to spoil it. Shut up. Okay, right. Aye, music, on you go, Matt. I'll, Carry go, on. I'll do this again. Let's Come on, hurry up and get on with it. Eh? Oh, I'm sorry. You're going to fight an edit point every time. Probably some folk have got to leave. <laughs> some folk have got to be here tonight. Musician, deed. We've got. A, I'm, it's not worth it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> New musician here. We've got Josh. He's, off, he's been off awfully quiet, but he's going to tell us about the banjo or singing that he did. Um, hi, my name's music. Josh. I'm a solo artist to play acoustic music. It's not and, um, sorry. So it's a one man <laughs> band. brought up to scratch on it. <laughs> Um, basically, I've just started up, and you can search me on Facebook and Twitter, just Joshua Barkley, just search that, and you'll find me, and follow me, and it, hope no. you like... <laughs> not yet. No, oh. <laughs> home, yeah. Oh. But, enough about me anyway, I'm more interested in the Toblerone. The Toblerone truck? And I would, I would like to add in something on the Toblerone. I think people should count how much nougat is in their Toblerone. How many pieces? Well, I think you could be on it, so my tracking system should be adapted to do that. I hope so. Well, Mark, I thought that would come off the top of your head there. No. no my, all, my only thing the Toblerone tracking system does is track Toblerone in Scotland. It's all it does so far. Bit of shit then, eh? But no, if you want to find Toblerone in Scotland. It's accurate for that. It's so, what happens? You're, you're chasing, we said, Toblerone. Well, well I, think I prefer right. I prefer it as maybe a hunt. It then crosses the border into England. What happens? No, no, not acceptable. So, no. just... No, no happening. Can't, can't do it. Can't leave Scotland. Toblerone tracking system is lo- Scotland only. 
So, but if a tow on then is in Scotland, it then crosses the border yes. into England, it then just disappears that's, in your tracking that, system. That, that's effectively, uh, that, that's what we call a dead tow balloon. It's, so it's, it's, it's a loss to us. So we, we try to cut them off before they get out of the border. You can just to save them for Aye, the horrific yeah. injuries they'll suffer over in England. <laughs> exactly. I mean, which would probably be the same as they'll suffer here. No, I mean, here, eaten. here they would get to be eaten by me. Mark just deep, deep fries them. Slowly deep, no, them. No, I, I, I didn't hear deep fryer. So deep fry, fry. How would I deep fry a tobler one? Why, why would you do that? That's cruel. I could do that in my work, easy enough. You can't That's even make sandwiches. Today, one time. You can't even make sandwiches. You've got to come in. Next week, you've got to come in by deep fried Toblerone. No, because I'll see it coming on my tracking system. <laughs> oh, wait. Maybe no, because the deep frying that ah, would that, hide it for your tracking system. And they're covering. That would ruin my system. Oh, you sneaky bastard. <laughs> It's so always a plan, Mark. Uh, I'm going to need to modify, you've, you've given me ideas, I'm going to modify the tracking system. Modify the track, there we go. Well, do it, www.toblerone tracking system. No, do, toblerone tracker.com. Or actually, just might, go, might, compare the toblerone. Might I add, did you spell it right? I did, because I was about to buy it and you goes, that's no spell right. And I thought, ooh, okay, <laughs> better get the right one. Mm. So, no, it is spell toblerone tracker.com and... Compare the Toblerone. No Toblerones, compare the Toblerone.com. What about we buy any Toblerone? I've not got that in yet. So none of you sneaky bastards go and get it. <laughs> and I'll, I, I should forward it to your website actually, but the new it kind of just says, hello, and that's about it. But you just had a whole rant on Toblerones. Toblerones. Oh. I mean, it's better than Faith Council. They're not even from... They don't make Toblerone in Scotland, <laughs> do they? No. This is show, the show spinning out of control. Well, this, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, that's what we should do. See these boats that we're getting ready with the cheese. We 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 take we swap them. We get ready. It's like it's like my immigration policy. Like <laughs> cheese one. goes out, Toblerone comes in. Exactly. All the Swiss could keep the fucking cheese, all that, and we bring the Toblerones in. How amazing would that be? You just see a boat coming with a fucking million Toblerones. It wouldn't even be a boat. It would be would change the name. Of it. it would be a Toblerone delivery system. Gas, do you even like Toblerone? I love Toblerone. <laughs> I've never, not once have I ever seen you eat one. Oh, well, see what I'm going to do next week. I'm going to buy loads of Toblerone. See, the quote from The thing was, is, you, you say that, but you actually offered Toblerone tonight <laughs> and then <laughs> failed. <laughs> get, <laughs> failed <laughs> to, to let us have a bit. Chloe, I'm not just, got, Chloe did give me two Toblerones for Christmas. Can like, you remember uh, your quote? No. Can you know? No. I do like Toblerone, but not as much as I go on about. <laughs> it's like scones. I never do exaggerate the Toblerone like this. Aye. But anyway, we, I it's, it's, it's like scones. I just go on about them, but I don't really like them. That a scone and tea, a half bath. Fuck off, scones are brilliant. They should be banned. You should be banned. They I should be out with the cheese. Snow shovel. Oh, cheese scones. Yeah, Help me with the snow shovel, Josh. It's a joke. A scone and tea, a half bath tea yeah, makes sure your. Th- fuck you! I'm getting through this. Makes the day a little brighter. <laughs> Steve's Keep your cheese. cakes and fancy tarts. <laughs> stick them up your shite, Eric. Exactly. Do you can, do you can, you can get Mark? Cheese scones. Fuck off. Cheese. <laughs> and a, that, that's terrorism there. You should be fucking brought up on charges for that. <laughs> cheese you can, scones. You what you're getting next week, yeah. You can, you'll be getting a fucking flame floor right up your ass. <laughs> oh, dear. Cheese scones. That's, that's like, oh, that's horrible. Cheese They're quite scones. nice, actually. No, it's not. It's horrible. Cheese baguettes. That's an afternoon that's gone. Get the baguettes in France. Away to fuck. You hear roll and bait. Actually, can you get this one? Croissant. Like, can you get Philadelphia a spread and cheese? Stick your croissant up your arse. Oh, croissant. I've seen a fucking word. <laughs> croissant. It's a French word. Hi. For fucking France. This is the France. This is Scotland. Stick <laughs> your croissants on the boat. Send them back to France. Get rid of them. Back to France. Gone. Well, fucking away. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not happy about this. You're, you're no, can you, can you get him Philadelphia spread and cheese? Yeah. Fuck off. Go on! Let's try another one, a different one the other day. You get chocolate spread and cheese. Oh, chocolate spread cheese. Chocolate cheese! Aye. <laughs> no! I've seen chocolate orange. Get, get. I've seen chocolate Philadelphia at work. And we know you do. Well, for it's long, I'm going to destroy it all. Make it suck. Probably will <laughs> be like your uh, vodka bottles. <laughs> These lights, the vodka bottles, we were walking the other day and he had a bottle of Dr. Pepper or something in his pocket. And we've seen the two neddiest fucks in Scotland walking past going, he's got a bottle of vodka in his pocket, he's got a bottle of vodka in his pocket. Right, Dr Pepper, as I'm sure you're aware, is black. Uh, <laughs> and vodka, I'm, I'm, I'm not a big drinker, I'll be honest with you, but vodka, in my opinion, has never been black. You do get blood you do vodka, get black. but... <sighs> Generally, vodka is no black. The majority of vodka I, is I, no I think the fact the Dr Pepper label on ah. the bottle... Might have been a giveaway. Um, we go on to the fact that 
we sell bottles of vodka that are plastic and the reason we discovered this is because somebody dropped one and it uh, you <laughs> I didn't I didn't announce it was you used me. to throw it to the new start it's the new what's the shite they're selling when you say we that was, was me and you so what did you do it's that? Work, see but that, that's why you used it you, know, you pretend you work hard shifts but instead you have vodka bottle fights <laughs> oh, no 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 this is just the new folk just to settle them in yeah. catch <laughs> Aye. That's a, that's a good thing. It's good. That, aye, anyway. Might add that that's 10 to 8 at the end of your thing. Yes, yeah, so what's I that? I thought that said fat checks, but it says 5 cans. Aye, 5 cans. <laughs> well, fat I, I bet fat you. Fat checks. <laughs> there's probably a few fat checks that work for 5 cans. That's probably a combined topic. I reckon we've got through most of what we wanted. It's, it's been a quick podcast tonight because uh, Craig's been quiet and I've not let him talk about boats. And Josh is quiet, eh? They're awfully quiet, Josh. But we will promote you. Search for you on Facebook for your Thank you very much. one man band. Just as a wee um, update here. And put, I'll put links on the website actually. Um, I say that, it'll probably take about three weeks for me to get room to that. It will happen. Adele okay. has won six prizes at the Grammys. Adele? Yeah. I like Adele. Adele's good. Won What's the Grammys much. though? It's Music Awards. <laughs> <laughs> it's Music Awards? Yes. Well, that'd be bad. Explain why Adele won then. The Grammy is shaped in the form of a Toblerone. <laughs> Josh, you're blowing my mind. Oh. I think I'm about to explode after that. Uh, no way, I mean, I could, is that, uh, I could, I could do this all night. <laughs> what did you just say? I think I'm about to explode after yeah, that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, we've, uh, we've no, anyway. Aye, it's Valentine's Day in the morning. So, uh, you better... Yeah, asparagus. You, aye, your Valentine's Day asparagus. Uh, and we sell, at uh, Sainsbury's we sell Valentine's asparagus. Aye. Miss folk sell flowers. No, it's supposed to be an aphrodisiac. Yeah. Uh, it's what every girl wants on Valentine's Day. Hey, asparagus. I, well, that would be quite painful if you ram. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Put your ram well, in where? These, Up these. Who? If you think about it, right? Bay asparagus or day. Mark, you're more likely to get bigger bay asparagus. But I'll just let that one tumbleweed its oh, way through the, the rooms. <laughs> Aye. What we need is we've got the board. What we need is a button on it for sound effects. Okay. So when Craig when Craig goes something like that, I was thinking on your on your live streams and that and aye. things like that. Actually, be able to get a tumbleweed rolling. Aye, aye. I, I like an overlay, a, a graphic over the screen. But to be honest, we'd never see us. It'd just be. Why don't you do a sound interpretation of a tumbleweed? I can do it. <laughs> Oh, prof- look at the professionalism. Oh, you, you, sh- you should be a musician. <laughs> <laughs> Funny that. <laughs> I know it. <laughs> Booming like a bass drum. Uh, uh, there you go. Um, what else? Has anybody got any other stories before I wrap up? Because I can't what you're like. <laughs> <laughs> He's just looking at me like I've got other stories. Oh, somebody got stabbed. Oh, we've talked about that. <laughs> <laughs> and, and there was a car crash at the toll bar as well. A 4x4 four four went on the roof. Nobody really cares much about our cares. A 4x4 four four went on the roof. <laughs> <laughs> Aye, a 4x4 four four ended up on the roof of the co-op. It's like fucking Santa Claus, but in reverse. Was it you that put it there? <laughs> well, I, just, I, got my bulldo- I got my bulldozer when they did a forklift and, and left it on the roof. I've heard about shoplifting, but I've never heard about car lift. <laughs> I lift shops all day. Aye. So I build up my muscles. It's because you're from metal. Uh, aye, so we've talked, what, what, what we've talked about uh, is not been quite riveting, but uh, that's because I've pretty much done the plan for this week. But like I say, next week to look forward to it, we're doing an independent special. Might be cut over two weeks, we're not sure, we'll see what happens because these kind of make the 27th. Because no, you're away to Uruguay. You no. could. I oh, could make it. You can make it. Aye, oh. you just away for about five, half five in the right, morning. Right, so that'll be a, Tuesday. Right, so that'll be an early one then. You, you could still make the one. Oh, but I've all, depending on how long independence debate takes, mm. you're going to split it in two weeks, aren't you? Aye, we probably will. But independence debate, so if you're into politics, give us a shout. Christina, can you're coming, you've not got a choice now, there's nobody else that likes politics, I don't think, so you're coming. Uh, and we'll be doing the video stream in HD, providing the posty does arrive at some point in the next month. Uh, week, actually. Stop the door in the mood. Well, it's, it's his door. <laughs> <laughs> I keep going round and he won't answer it. Kins, it's me. He just sees me that's coming. Co- that's because you're not big enough. <laughs> <laughs> I said he sees me coming. It's because you're not big enough. That doesn't make sense, Dean. No. He sees you coming. <laughs> he says you're one... The part that he's wanting isn't the big you're enough. You're one pyramid short of a Toblerone, that's what he says. <laughs> oh, it's brilliant. This guy, where have where you been? This is brilliant. I mean, I have th- I've thought of the Toblerone trans system, but I've never thought of a Toblerone joke. That's good. That's good material. 
Yeah. 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 We'll call it even. Right. Right. So That's because I'm a pal. I'll, I'll let you off with that. A prick. Annoying. <laughs> Personal arse looking. I knew you'd come that in. That sometimes does crop up, but <laughs> <laughs> that's another story. Uh, <laughs> usually that's a freebie though. Uh, <laughs> Steve's face is a picture. Uh, Where is this? <laughs> well... <laughs> 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 Oh, I would certainly no comment on a thing like that. And I... You did, though. I, but I'd like to lie. Um, <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie about lying. We're on HD next week, providing the post he comes. No jokes there, please. Uh, the YouTube videos will be up. We've put uh, for video for 3 through 11 podcasts. We don't have a video for 1 and 2. Uh, and 3 has gone up shortly. So 3 through 11 is on YouTube. Uh, this is 12, this will be up on YouTube the morning, um, and 13 will be the first one that comes in HD. See, since uh, we missed be the sure. best video clip of the lot. I hope we've got the clip where Craig talks about an atlas to drive together. No. I was thinking we could no. maybe re this no, famous. No, 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 no. Oh yes, because the one week that you hit Craig with a snow shovel was the week that I forgot to record the Ustream. No, we could. no, no. I reckon that's a no. See, when you say no, does that mean you mean aye? <laughs> no, I didn't at all. Aye, that. I normally so accept like no as an aye. That's usually what it means. Usually what that means. Aye. That's so, got you into trouble a few occasions. I'm uh, never convicted. Uh, aye. So, find us on YouTube. All the links are on the website. As always, markisrants.com. We post it on Facebook. I'll hopefully edit the thing quite shortly <coughs> um, <laughs> ok right you have offered to edit a four and never done it excuse Sounds me neat. I've never offered to edit right ah you have you said oh they can what I'm doing with computers but I'll edit no I never oh, you I, did. I said I they can what I'm doing with computers so there's no point in me editing to be honest the editing is basically export save us <laughs> ah, you never edit it you? <laughs> no right. since this is getting edited out boobs ah, that's stayed in for like four years so very good ah Next week will be good. Um, that's uh, pretty much all we've got to say, unless you just want to say anything before I wrap up. You can find us all on Facebook, as ever. The links are on that. Oh, Meadows Marathon as well. If you could donate to us, that would be fantastic. It's for mm-hmm. the Willow Foundation. Uh, we're all running it on, well, we'll say we all missed us. The 4th of March, Sunday. It's a Sunday. It's at the Meadows. Imagine that. Come out and support us if you are going to donate. Alright, it's in uh, Edinburgh. Just, it'll be a good day. Daniel's uh, actually right. put his name down for uh, help moot. Is it? Oh, Brian. He's volunteered help. Who's doing that? Daniel. Fan Dan. Fan Daniel. Oh, excellent. So, uh, good eye. Help out or run it or just even if you do want to do that, go along, support everybody. It'll be a good laugh. Uh, throw stuff at us as we run past. Uh, Give Mark a donut. Donuts, donuts, donuts would be perfect if you throw a Toblerone. <laughs> throw me a Toblerone. Uh, I'll, I'll basically stop running. I'll just. Kim, what's going to happen? New folks going to be standing outside with Toblerones going. Look oh. what I've got and you've no. <laughs> Oh, They're going to be teasing you. With an empty box, that'd be well, funny. <laughs> well, I thought of it. See, what well, Craig, Craig found like a bag, right? But it was Chewbacca clinging onto you. And I thought, I was going to do it, but 50 quid. That's, um, you know, find a cheaper one on eBay. Oh, that's where we found it, eBay. Because uh, yeah. Craig, I'm sure Craig found it, like, it was for like Canada or something. And then I found one on eBay. Australia. Uh, Australia. And it, no what, difference. 40 or, well, the Canadian Australian there seemed funny. Um, <laughs> but. That's what they say about you. Sorry, I can have seen funny, I've seen Scottish and I'm happy with it. I'm accepted that, I've lived it, I've lived with it, I'm, I'm moving on, I'm accepting it. That's not the reason why they say that you're funny. It's alright, it's cool, <laughs> what do you mind? They're pricks anyway. It's just offended everybody in Australia and Canada, but there you go. It's not much. <laughs> nah, it's a wee population, it's not a big place, is it? Oh. I forgot what I was talking about. Ah, Meadows Marathon as well. <laughs> Hi, um, so we're all doing it for the Willow Foundation. Uh, they help folk from 16 to 40. I think in why the age restriction? Like, if you're 41? It's just meant to be adults. Oh, right. Like, that, that's how they, they, they age for oh, the age right. of Anyway, 16 to 40. Um, you, you'd hate to be 16 to 40 to donate. That's just who the Willow Foundation help. Uh, I'd be brilliant. If you could donate or come along, uh, whatever, we'll all be doing it. 13.1 miles. So, I'll be fucking deed by the end of it. 
Uh, we're aiming for tours, I believe. That's what my aim is anyway. Are we, are we having our walk tomorrow? I would do I want to do it early though, because I'm doing. I have to be in Kirkcaldy for eight, and I'll be back about half past or nine. Do it about then, if that's all right with you. The early. Mm-hmm. Plus, the earlier it is, the less likely you'll go through me in front of a bus. Be less buses. I'd be thinking about that. I'd be about that. Less cars then, because all day will be like, they'll, they'll, oh, they'll be rush you at 8 o'clock to get out of the house, and then by 9 10 it'll be kind of quiet. It'll be fine. Well, that's my plan anyway. Ah, so if you're around Kennaway leaving me in the area of the moon, come out and uh, see us walking about. Throw stuff at us, like Toblerones. So are you happy with that? Everybody's happy. Name your stories that you want to bring up this week. You just give me that look like I've got a story, I'm just not telling you. What? No, no, yet. No, 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 yet. <laughs> well, you're kind of we're coming to the end here, Craig. So you're halfway through this, wrap them up. This, this, you wait till I'm halfway through wrap up. That's by the way, I, I just something I like to add. On another note, Paisley's a shite hole. Ah, Paisley. Not just Paisley. I mean, Aberdeen. So Jared Butler. Jared Butler. Ah, yeah. No, Aberdeen's fine. It's, it's a shite it's hole. Pa- no, it's no. It's a shite hole. Aberdeen's not a shite hole. Shite Aberdeen's hole. great. It's a shite hole. Shop. It's a shite it, hole. Right, you need to be putting a like a padded room with knives. Anyway. This is uh, it's been a quiet episode, I reckon, like, because I was quite, I've been quite cheerful at night. I'm usually to laid back. Aye, I don't know, I, I blame uh, you. <laughs> I'm not sure why, <laughs> but when in doubt. Aye, quite right, quite rightly so. So, check out all our links on Facebook and uh, the website markisrants.com, everybody who's at .com, hive.com, markisrants.com, go there, find all the links, we'll post uh, links to Josh's musical page on Facebook and whatever. Uh, all the Meadows links are on that as well. Uh, pictures, uh, boats are no be on the website. I can assure you, that's a bad <laughs> thing. Donate, donate, donate. Yes, uh, to anyone else. It's all going in the same cause, but whatever. Um, thank you for listening. Uh, I'm Mark Lamont. I'm Craig Dockery. I'm Andrew Dees. I'm Joshua Barkley. And that'll do us for this week. Fantastic. The fifth hundred person to donate. Mark is giving a car away. <laughs> <laughs> with dodgy brakes. <laughs> Not with dodgy brakes. It's a brand new car, state of the art, and he is willing to. I 